What's up guys, Logan Franklin here with MHP and Muscle and Strength. We're at Iron City Gym in Houston, so stay tuned. We're gonna get you guys a good chest workout. We're gonna warm up with some light incline dumbbells. We're just keeping the bench at a 45 degree incline and just cruising with it until we get some blood in the muscle. Right now, just with my chest, I'm trying to get some overall fullness, but I'm really, really trying to isolate my upper pectoral so I can get that Arnold pec and it can sit out like a shelf. I feel like I close the gap on my chest and uh, I'll be a lot harder to beat. I mean, if it's my heaviest set, I might as well go for the 135s. So for the second exercise today, we're moving on to a flat hammer strength machine. So trying to get that mid range and a little bit of upper pec. So what I did was I just lowered the seat just slightly. So it's a little bit higher than mid pec. And uh, just keeping shoulders back, keep your chest up and just squeezing all chest. You don't ever want to let your shoulders round forward because then you're going to hit shoulders. So make sure you're keeping your scapula retracted and just press with your chest. I'm gonna go as many as I can and then drop it. And then uh, go to two. Okay. Uh. Uh, fuck. Another thing for a lot of you guys that are just now starting to get in here, or maybe have been in here for a few years, and you're trying to develop your physiques a certain way, man, don't come in here, you know, and thinking you have to be the strongest person in the gym and lifting heavier than everybody else. I mean, you know, strength is gonna come, but really we're in here trying to shape our muscles and look best on stage, because your strength isn't gonna show on stage, your physique is. So come in here and focus on form, focus on squeezing the muscle, and focus on having that intensity in the gym. And you do that, and it's gonna go a lot longer, a lot further away than just coming in here and trying to lift as heavy as the weight as you can with sloppy form. The goal is to get my chest, like, no pump, as big as it is with the pump. So well, that's everybody's fucking goal, right? <laughs> a little trick on these flies. Uh, try to tell everybody that starts training with me or or guys that are just now starting to work out and they're trying to have some help uh, activating more of their pec on their flies is think about not bringing the weight in with your hands, like thinking of doing this. Think about 
trying to touch the insides of your elbows together, and it's gonna get more of a squeeze with your chest. Uh. A lot of people wonder how I stay so lean in the off season. And uh, this is where it starts, is right here. And it's uh, that intensity in the gym. All right guys, so the next exercise we're moving into is some dips. Do not neglect these guys, I'm telling you. I neglected them for about a year and a half and I saw uh, the decrease in chest fullness from just not doing this exercise. So make sure to keep these in your routine. It's gonna train a lot of the pec major, so a lot of that roundness of your pec is gonna help push the chest out. So the last thing we're doing on our chest day, just some flat bench, just trying to make sure that we give everything that we've got. You know, leave no question, no doubt that we annihilated our chest. So uh, I'm just gonna go as heavy as I can for as many sets as we can. <laughs> that's it for our chest workout today here in Iron City Gym Houston muscle and strength thank you guys for watching subscribe below peace